history is less than a month away and the internet is pouring out their ideas and predictions and a lot of these seem to be the same predictions over and over and over again. And whether I agree with most of these predictions or not, I wanted to switch things up just a little bit. Let's take a look at my E3 predictions that won't happen, but I really wish they would. In 1996, the Super Nintendo got a brilliant game known as Super Mario Ooh. RPG, and I would kill for the game to be announced, Super Mario RPG 2. Now I know I have talked about the game before on this channel, so I will steer clear of any history. Super Mario RPG is a game that deserves a real, true, honest sequel. This Square Nintendo hybrid brought us some new characters, and I would love to see these characters return, but for Nintendo to also introduce us to some new, fresh friends. I would be more than happy if the game was multiplayer, because if the game came out on the Nintendo Switch, being able to play a Super Mario RPG Part 2 anytime, anywhere on the Switch with a friend sounds fantastic. I'm pretending that I'm playing with my friends! Recently, Mario Rabbids Kingdom Battle gave me a Super Mario RPGs type vibe and I adored the game. I, oddly enough, want the original style graphics back, just done in HD. And I know there has been some random rumors of this possibly happening, but I'm not believing anything till I hear it from Nintendo themselves. And please, please, please bring Yoko Shimamura back for the soundtrack. Oh my gosh, it was brilliant. My next wish that won't happen is that Silent Hills comes back. When I first played PT back on the PlayStation 4, the game was fantastic. It was an amazing experience altogether as a game. It was the definition of what I loved in the horror genre of video games. All this was topped by the news that we were getting a new Silent Hill game starring Norman Reedus and directed by Guillermo del Toro and then it was cancelled no, just no. like that. This beyond broke my heart. I was looking forward to this game more than any game I can think of in any recent history at all. More than excited. I'm freaking out! It's Silent Hill! What the heck? I, there's nothing else I want more than a new Silent Hill game developed by some amazing people, directed by some amazing people, uh, Norman Reedus in there. I'm kind of freaking out over the moon about this, I'll be honest, so I couldn't be happier. I know there are so many reasons this probably has like a 2% chance of ever happening, but I am going to hold on to that 2% chance. I hate politics in the video game industry. I know Konami has screwed up. I know Kojima is doing his own thing. Please be good, Death Stranding. But you can't blame me for wishing and hoping for the best possible news to ever come out of an E3 announcement for me personally. Cuphead 2 on all consoles. Do I really need to convince anybody of anything right now? Cuphead brought to us some of the greatest platforming, visuals, music, and gameplay ever put into a video game. I remember talking about Cuphead at E3 with Maker Studios in 2015, and man, I was hyped. Mickey Mouse cartoon and it just comes to life in your hands. So it's like a dream come true. I love it. And even as you see back there, IGN, best at E3. It's not just me. Cuphead, you need it in your life. It's coming. I know Cuphead 2 is going to get announced eventually in the future. This game was a winner on all levels. But for now, I can daydream that it's going to get announced this next month at E3 2018. Dreaming that we get two more characters added to the mix. A four player couch co-op mode. Yes, I love the mayhem. 
new abilities, and some sort of online co-op play as well. All in all, the title for this video could be defined by this choice. E3 predictions that won't happen, we wish would. God, I so wish. My final prediction that won't happen that I really wish would is that Fortnite gets removed from the internet completely and from all consoles. Bring the hate, bring the hate. All right guys, that's it. Make sure to like the video, please. We would appreciate it also to subscribe. We are here basically five days a week doing stuff with you guys. Thank you for watching Superhero Game Squad. Make sure to check out SuperheroGameSquad.com if you want to see any other things we got going on that you guys don't know about here. All right, talk to you guys later. Have a good one. Shining Aura. See you at E3.